Race now getting set for her free skate, oh, yes. the youngest American, B.B. Lang. The marks for Luann Donovan in the range of 4.7 to 5.5, five, mostly in the low five range. She is currently in first place. B.B. Lang, meantime, fifth place entering the free skate, but she does have a shot at a medal. Her mom, Alice, first took B.B. and her older sister to skating lessons after watching the Olympics in 1994. Bibi will skate to music from Cirque du Soleil. She has an outside chance at the podium. The best thing she can do here for herself to get there is to skate a very strong performance. And then she'll have to hope that a couple of others maybe make some mistakes along the way. But the goal for her is to put down a program that'll pressure the balance of this field. Opening with a triple Lutz combination. And speaking of pressure, it got to her there. No triple combination, no triple at all. It comes back and shows good determination in attempting the triple triple toe combination. Hang on to the landing of the triple flip. This has been a season of emotional highs for Bibi. She got to participate in the opening ceremony of the Olympic Games skated in a number that also featured Christy Yamaguchi. A successful landing of that triple loop jump puts a big smile on her face. Little triple sow cow double toe combination. attempt the triple lutz that she missed off the top no mistake with that attempt she could just have back the beginning of the program she'd be in great shape i would imagine this is a great learning experience though 13 years old out here in a world competition oh she'll be back there's no doubt about that and the very valid point is that as a junior the experience is what these competitions are all about. Little. Double axle was the final jump of the program. And it was like she had opening minute jitters. First three jump components of this program did not go very well at all, but from that point forward, it was a solid performance. Came back awfully strong, B.B. Lang. It was pretty evident from her approach at the beginning of the program that she knew she wanted to skate probably the best performance she's been ever able to do. But that pressure in and of itself tightened her up a little bit. She couldn't let things happen out there in that first minute, and it cost her. And then maybe she relaxed after that. Bibi has never landed a triple-toe, triple-toe combination in competition, but she comes very close here. On the first jump, it goes relatively well. She may touch down in the landing there of the first jump, but doesn't carry enough speed to give her an honest chance at the second jump and has to put her hand down to prevent herself from falling. 
Watching this setup to her double axle. Right there. Her heel catches on her right foot. That would unnerve you considerably, but she puts it behind her immediately. Puts up this nice double axle to finish the program on a very positive note. And the first set of marks for Bibi Lang. These are the marks for technical merit in the range of 4.8 to 5.4. Those are pretty high. Considering the mistakes she had early on, they're very good. They obviously recognized the quality of the elements that she did compete and rewarded her for them. BB with her coach Tiffany Chin, who won this event in 1981. And the second set of marks for eight up to a 5-5. Five, five. For now, B.B. Lang is in first place. We'll return to Hamar, Norway right after this.